It's me, so y'all. Welcome to my kitchen today, where today I'm going to be showing you how to make a very special item. It's good for party time, snack time, gift time, any time. Yeah, peanut brittle. How good is that? Let's get started. So we're going to need some peanuts, some sugar, some corn syrup, some people call it Cairo syrup, and some water. So in this pot, I have already placed my sugar, my water, and my corn syrup. So I'm going to just let this come up to boil and it's going to be heating. It's already, you know, heating now. My sugar is already dissolving. And what I need to do is just stay right here and babysit this little guy. Yeah, I got to stay right here and keep it stirred and keep the action going because I don't want it to burn. I don't want it to stick. I don't want any kind of trouble out of this guy. <laughs> Look at it. Isn't it beautiful? Look at the bubbles. Oh, it's just going and going and going. So I have this speeded up just for the interest of time. It's going to take me about, say, 12 minutes for it to get this where I want it to be. But I don't want you to sit here and watch me just stare for t uh, 12 minutes, just staring and staring and staring in the pot. Not that interesting. So I'm going to have some snappy little conversation, and I'm also going to speed it up so that we can take a look and get out of here and start eating some peanut brittle. Okay. Now, believe it or not, this is just sugar and corn syrup and water, and it smells good already. I know some of you are like, me, so what's wrong with you? But it does. I kid you not, it smells good. Look and look. Now, I'm liking this color. I'm liking the color point that it's at. Let me go ahead and test this. I have a bowl with water and ice in it, and I'm going to just drop some of this syrup down here and see what it's like. So it's not hard. It's soft. It's malleable. Uh, this is a soft uh, boil stage, and this is about where I want it. So I'm going to go ahead and get my peanuts in, y'all. That doesn't look like enough. Let me add some more peanuts. So I just put in here a 16-ounce can of peanuts, and I'm going to just let it cook just a little while longer. Uh, just another few minutes. Ah, mm, mm, mm. now I know, I know, I say it all the time, but my oh my, I wish you could smell this. Oh God, so good. If your kids are at home, they're gonna be standing all around the stove. They're gonna be standing all around waiting on this. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. You gotta be real careful though, because if any of this syrup gets on your skin, then it's gonna be a different story. It is hot out the wazoo. Still staring. That's all this video is, just a video of staring. <laughs> okay, so I just cut the heat off of this and um, I just added a, a tablespoon of vanilla flavoring and I am um, coming right back with a teaspoon of baking soda. Now watch this. Oh, I think this is so beautiful when it gets begins to turn and look different. Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah, oh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Ah, oh, yeah. My mouth is watering already. Now look, here is my countertop. And I have uh, greased this with, with margarine. And uh, I don't know why I did this. I knew better. I knew better than to put this on my countertop. I should have used uh, a sheet pan, some parchment paper, some foil, anything except just my countertop grease, but I did. I don't know why I did this. You know, some days you're just not all there. But anyway, I put this on here. I let it cool. You put yours on a parchment aluminum or a baking sheet. I had a little bit of trouble getting it up. You see all the little, all the little uh, crumbs around, but it wasn't too bad. The peanut brittle is still good. You don't believe me? Look at this. Look at this. Wouldn't you like to have some of that? Mm -mm. Now, my son doesn't even like peanut brittle. He tasted this and he's like, oh my God, that is so fresh. That is so delicious. It's better than any I've ever had. Yeah, it was made today. Yeah. Oh, guys, look at this. Look at this. Give this to the kids, teachers, the bus driver, the mailman, uh, your UPS guy, you know, whoever it is that you want to give a nice little holiday gift to. They'll love it. I want to thank you guys for coming by my channel today because you knew I'd be throwing down. I'd be cooking something good. So I want to thank you guys. If you like my channel, I want you to share it with wherever you're active on social media. I want you to subscribe. I want you to comment. I want you to give me a thumbs up. 
Hey, go out in the world, share some of your special brand of love today. Bye-bye.